Hey everyone, Kiwi King 77 here from the AC Syndicate team here with my Motorola Photon 4G to do a video showing you how to flat install the Synergema 9 Alpha build on your Motorola Photon. Pretty much everything is working. I believe camera is just the main thing that isn't working. Uh, but anyways, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to install it. The um, install method is a little bit different, so definitely going to want to watch this video if you have a Photon. I'll also be doing a separate review video, so be sure to check that out as well. But anyways, uh, what you're going to need to do is make sure you have Clockwork Mod installed or Custom Recovery Twerp 2.0 or whatever you decide to have. Click on the link in the description. It takes you to this site. Big shout out and thanks to Jokers AX11. He's a really good dev. Um, he does good work, so be sure to give him a thanks. Anyways, as you can see, CM9 Alpha. Um, the builds will be located right here, so click on this link, and it takes you to this download website. What you're going to need to do is install two uh, files, the Alpha 13 update CM9, or if it's updated, whatever, um, download this one, and then the Joker G apps. So make sure you download both of those, and both of them will look like this. Alpha 13 update zip and Joker GFs v3 zip. So make sure you have both of those. Make sure you get it onto your Photon uh, internal or external storage. Make sure you have it on your Photon. Once it's done, you are ready to go. I'm going to go ahead and power off my device. All right, now that my phone has powered off, we're going to need to go into our custom recovery. Press and hold the volume down and power button at the same time. Keep both of them held down until fast boot pops up at the top of the screen, like so. Then press the volume down button until it uh, says Android Recovery up at the top. And then press the volume up button to select it. What that's gonna do is go ahead and reboot your device into your custom recovery, whether it's Clockwork Mod, where I have Clockwork Mod installed, as you can see right there. Anyways, what you're going to need to do to install this ROM is go down to Mount and Storage. I believe if you have Twerp 2.0, you're going to need to go to Wipe, and it's in your Wipe menu. Go to what? Mount and Storage, and then go to Format System. So Format System, right there. So make sure you format your system. Now, and well, and hit Yes. So go ahead and format your system. I forgot how long it takes for the Photon to flash anything or wipe anything in recovery. Alright, as you can see, done. Now just hit Go Back, and now go to Wipe Data Factory Reset. So, wipe your data, include SDXT in Wipe, say No, and hit Yes, delete all user data. So go ahead and make sure all your data gets wiped. Um, make sure you back everything up, your contacts, apps, etc that you want, would like to back up. All right, as you can see, data wipe complete. Now what you're gonna to need to do is go to the advanced menu. So go to your advanced menu and then just hit um, reboot recovery up at the top. So hit reboot recovery. What that's gonna do is reboot your Photon back into your custom recovery. All right, so now it, it has rebooted me back into Clockwork Mod. And now what you're going to need to do is go to Install Zip from SD Card. Uh, choose Zip from SD Card or Internal SD Card, wherever you have it. And then find the ROM itself. So find that Alpha 13 update CM, whatever, and then hit Yes, Install. So go ahead and install the ROM. It's going to go ahead and install. Be patient with it. It does take its time during the install process. All ROMs do on the Photon. But anyways, go ahead and let it install. All right, so as you can see, install from SD card. Complete the ROM install is done. Now go back to choose it from SD card and then find that Joker G Apps V3 that you downloaded earlier and hit yes, install. So go ahead and install the ROM itself, the G Apps. What the G Apps is is Market, Google Talk, I believe Gmail, just other... Google apps that are included with this ROM. All right, now install from SD card complete. Now what you're gonna need to do is just go ahead and hit go back and then reboot system now. So go ahead and reboot your Motorola Photon. First boot up is gonna take longer than usual, so be patient with it. Um, if it's taking longer than 10 minutes, something definitely went wrong. But anyways, go ahead and let this boot up. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and let this boot up. You're not done yet. Um, go ahead and let it reboot, and once it boots up, I will be back. 
All right, so now it went ahead and rebooted. I'm going to go ahead and just hit power off because now we're gonna to need to go back into clockwork mod. So power off your photon. Now that it's powered off, we're gonna to need to go back into our custom recovery, volume down and power button again. Same method as we did earlier until fast boot pops up, then volume down until Android recovery comes up, press volume up button to select it. And now it should reboot you into your custom recovery again. Should boot me into clockwork mod. Now all you're gonna to need to do is go to wipe data slash factory reset. So go to wipe data factory reset, hit no, and then hit yes, delete all user data. So now go ahead and format your data again and I'll be back once it's done. All right, now that your data wipe is complete, just go ahead and go down to install zip from SD card, select it, choose it from SD card, and then install the ROM again. So install your Alpha 13 CM9 ice cream sandwich ROM, and it's gonna go ahead and run through the install process. Again, I will be back once it's done. All right, install from SD card complete. The ROM has finished. Now go back to choose zip from SD card and then navigate to that Joker GFs V3 again and hit yes, install Joker G apps. So same process as before, install the ROM, install the G apps, and um, I'll be back once it's done. Okay, install from SD card complete. Now hit go back and reboot system now and you are done, finally. So you're done installing C CM9 Alpha ROM on your Motorola Photon 4G. As I said, I'm gonna be doing a separate review video, so I'm gonna let this boot up and do a separate review video. So definitely gonna to wanna to check that out. I'll link to that in the description of the video. Uh, be sure to subscribe to me, follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. All links will be down in the description. And as always, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. And as you can see, stock ice cream sandwich boot animation.